Hello, my name is Anam Clark from the Designer Studio. In today's tutorial, we'll be adding a real outdoor view into your SketchUp model. Adding views outside your SketchUp model can really bring it to life. So how does one do this? Very simply, I have set a scene. You can also reposition yourself back in your SketchUp model as you wish. I'm just going to now zoom extents out of the model. I'm going to create an arc right outside my window. I'm then going to offset the arc slightly. I'll join up the edges and then simply push pull this upwards to around the ceiling height. I can then make this into a group and then add a new tag. Hold view. I will then place this into the view under my entity info. I'm now going to turn around and grab a view. You can grab these from Google if you wish, or you can get a real photo yourself. Specifically, this works well for beautiful views out of clients' homes, so they know that you are specifically designing for them. I'm then going to now look at a view specifically, a night scene. And save that up for myself. to add it to my desktop as view. I will then actually hide the rest of my pieces and go to import locate my view, click, hover, click and explode. Immediately delete. I'm going to grab my materials where it will fall under and go into colors in model. I will then simply paste it onto my curve that I have made. I'm not too worried about the height to be honest. However, if you are, you can increase the size. So if it goes 6,000, it will increase the size. And then I'm going to hit close and then edit and hide all. So now if I go back to my scene one, I have this beautiful view of the city outside. If you want to see it a little bit more prominently, you can delete a pane of glass and go back and see your beautiful view. I hope you have enjoyed today's tutorial. It's really important to add views to your windows to make the interior and exterior synonymous with each other. It convinces your clients to actually visualize the space that they're working in. Don't forget to subscribe and look out for more tutorials.